Hey everyone and welcome back to another video from Coco's Cosmology. In today's video, we're going to be doing our weekly predictions for our Scorpios and signs. So let's go ahead and get right into you guys' reading. What is going on with my Scorpio Sun, Moon, and Rising signs for the week of February 7th? through February 13th. What can they expect? What should they look out for? And what energy is surrounding them? All right, you guys, quick disclaimer before we get right into you guys' this reading. For some of you guys, this energy is going to happen in chronological order. And for other of you guys, this energy is going to happen sporadically throughout the week. So just take what resonates with you. All right, what's going on with my Scorpio, Sun, Moon, and Rising signs? First card to come out is the High Priestess. The world. The page of cups. Temperance. We have the nine of wands in reverse. The eight of wands upright. And the two of wands. Alright. Back of deck energy. Let me pick up the deck again. Back of deck energy is justice. So the energy that you have during this week, Scorpio, is all about having fairness. Okay. The back of deck energy is a major arcana card. So with this card being major. It's a major feeling that you're feeling. You're fighting for things that are right. You're fighting for things to bring balance into your life or into others' lives. Also, with this card, you know, you may be getting very, you know, creative with how you speak with other people, um, how you bring up points, how you're showing your objective to things, and you're letting them know, hey, I just want balance. I just want fairness. And I'm not giving up on that until I get what I ask for. Right? So, looking at the spread, you guys do have three major arcana cards. But it's a fourth one, including uh, the back of deck energy. So, with the first card, you do have the high priestess. Okay, so during this week, you guys are going to be tapping into your intuition. Okay, and also this card is about justice and fairness as well. So that's a big thing that is surrounding you during this week. Um, something may be going on at your place of work, um, your place of residence, um, with family members or friends. And you may be fighting for, you know, justice for them. Or you may be fighting for justice just for yourself um, as far as the wages that you may be getting paid at your job. You may be going hard for that during this week, not letting up, inquiring about when the raise is going to be, how much are they going to pay you, you negotiating payments. And also with this card, you know, you're going to be following your intuition. You know how far to go and how little, you know, to say and how much to say with this energy okay and then you guys do have the world card now with the world card this energy is somebody who is going to you know be celebrating i feel like you guys are going to be reaching your goals this week um it's time to celebrate that you've received your raise or some of you guys may be moving 
whatever the reason why i say moving is because you do have the eight of wands a lot of you guys may be traveling or moving at some point during this week you may be signing the papers signing the lease um a lot of you guys you know you may be completing something a lot of you guys may be celebrating because you may be finally leaving your nine to five or you may be you know leaving your residence whatever it is it could be something coming to a complete end and you guys are celebrating for it and it makes you feel you know excited happy and whole again all right now with the page of pentacles you guys this is the type of energy of somebody who is receiving good news about money so i really do feel like a lot of you guys will be um getting a raise during this week a lot of you guys may be you know getting good news about some type of material a lot of you guys may be getting a property um from one of your family members um and also a lot of you guys are going to be recognize you guys are going to be feeling appreciated i feel like this was how you guys this last week reading was and is still continuing on unless it was the week before but you guys are being appreciated you know you guys are being recognized for the work that you've done people realize how much work that you put in every single week and they like hold on wait a second she deserves this raise she or he deserves this raise um, she or he may bring you know so much balance into the company or so much balance into this friendship or so much balance into this person's life it may be a client whatever it may be you guys there's so much balance surrounding you with this temperance card all right also a lot of you guys may go deep into healing this week or being creative like i was saying you guys may be getting very creative with your words um with the high priestess energy you know when you're negotiating with people when you're trying to bring balance and fairness into your life so i see that a lot with the temperance card i also see that you know some healing um maybe going on you guys may be getting into arts and crafts this week you may be doing some dancing yoga um, exercising singing um, art you know coloring painting or of some of the sort um, during this week so pay attention to those energies as it comes about all right and you guys do have a lot of fire energy at the end of the week so you have the nine of wands you know in reverse um, and this is somebody who you know may be giving in you know just letting go um, I feel like you guys are just going to be kind of like exhausted from the entire week. I don't see you guys giving in to anything, but for some of you guys, you may be giving in to someone's BS for a short moment. You know what I'm saying? It's not really major because I do see you guys um, do have the Eight of Wands energy supporting that. And it's upright and that's somebody who is going to be communicating the things that they need to say to anybody it could be to somebody of a fire sign leo um aries sagittarius so this is the type of energy that is you know surrounding this eight of wands also like i was saying a lot of you guys may be moving during this week or thinking about moving so i see for a movement going in that direction um some of you guys may be communicating with like some type of leasing agency a realtor whatever it may be so you know these are the type of things that are coming up for you guys during this week and then you have the two of wands okay now with the two of wands i see a lot of success coming your way during this week scorpio this is a very successful week for you guys to express how you feel for you guys to get things done for you guys to fight for justice for you guys to get a raise for you guys to move um so you guys are definitely going to be putting in that work this week all right so what we're going to do scorpio is we're going to shuffle the numerology cards to see what you guys should mainly focus on during the week of february 7th through february 13th what should my scorpios okay so a lot of you guys do have number 63 parenting so a lot of you guys may be having to find balance um, with the temperance card between your work life and your home life.
um, you guys do have nature so a lot of you guys need to go out in nature um, tap into your creativity with the temperance card you know find balance within that and then a lot of you guys do have 85 follow your dreams a lot of you guys need to tap into what is it that you really want to do to be successful how is that going to bring balance into your life if you go hard if you continue going hard if you don't let up you know but also make sure you schedule out time every week for you to pamper yourself love on yourself and you know have those spa days or those relaxation days you know what i'm saying like at least once a week for you to recoup and regather um and that's where leadership comes in at you know what i'm saying take take ownership of your life follow your dreams go out in nature and explore enjoy the earth get earthy you know come down to earth um and you know focus on you know your parenting following your dreams your leadership balance you know that justice fight for fairness during this week scorpio let's see what other type of energies are surrounding my scorpio sun moon and rising signs for the week of february 7th through february 13th all right so we're shuffling the moon allergy cards for that you guys a lot of you guys already know what time it is. <laughs> like, girl, we know how this goes. Woo. Okay. So the first card to come out is your hard work is paying off new moon in Capricorn. And we most definitely see that during the end of the week with this eight of wands energy and the two of wands energy, because the eight of wands is somebody who is moving forward, who is accelerating in their life. And then the two of wands is showing that, wow, this is a success. You're going to be successful. You know what I'm saying? Your plans that you've set are going to be a success. You're going to achieve your goals. So that is the beautiful thing about seeing that come up first and it's right up under the eight of wands so it's very beautiful okay next card you have is hold your vision okay so i feel like holding your vision has a lot to do with following your dreams and bringing that balance into your life can i get one more card for my scorpio sun moon and rising sign you may have strong Capricorn energy surrounding you. It could very well be my energy. I am a Capricorn. And then we have a look at the bigger picture, full moon in Sagittarius. Okay, period. So that's crazy how it came out that your hard work is paying off. Some of you guys may be giving in, like it said with the nine of wands, you may be getting tired, getting burnt out. And then spirit is like, hey, your hard work is paying off. Keep going, keep moving forward. And then the two of wands is like, hold on, hold your vision, write your plans out. It's going to be a success. Keep going. And then Sagittarius full moon in Sagittarius comes in like hey look at the bigger picture there's more to see than what you're looking at at the moment so it's so beautiful Scorpio so what we're going to do is shuffle the astrology cards to see what other energies are surrounding you guys during this week so you do have the fifth house energy which is Leo energy where you have fun romance and create things you are proud of you have Venus energy, which is Libra and Taurus energy surrounding you. The part of you that desires beauty, success, indulgence, and valuables. So I do see a lot of success coming this week. And then you do have the seventh house, which is Libra once again coming to <laughs> support you. This area of your life, it's about long-term significant partners, romantic business, or family. So yeah, I do see a lot of you guys trying to balance like your beauty, your success, your family life, your significant other, your business life. All of those things are, you know, supporting you during this week. So let's see what messages you guys do have from spirit that can help you you know throughout the week of february 7th through february 13th what message do you guys have for my scorpios okay 
first card is weight of the world boundaries let it go is not yours to carry a lot of you guys do need to let go of anything that does not serve you anything that's not supporting you anything that's not taking care of you or helping elevate um, find justice in that find balance in that you also do have messengers serious energy bringing harmony and balance a lot of you guys may be getting some type of positive messages from a family member during this week you may be getting motivated this reading may be motivating you to continue going to keep continue uplifting yourself um that may be your message for the week you do have forge don't follow pave a new path be the leader you wish you had and you do have leadership take ownership of your life during this week scorpio and then another message you have is the blue flame spontaneous awakening activation integration time and i feel like this activation is going to allow you to charge full force for your dreams with this eight of wands energy all right, Scorpios, I hope you guys enjoyed this reading. Please give it a thumbs up. Leave comments down below. Subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you won't ever miss an upload. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.